Oh god! Oh god, hold on! What's up, let's see what's going on. My name is Master Kill, and welcome to Tales of Bazaria. <laughs> 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 But on the serious though, hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Master Gill, and welcome to Tales of Berseria. This game is just dropped along with Kingdom Hearts 2.8 and Resident Evil 7, I think. And I've been dying to play this game. In case you guys haven't <clears throat> haven't no noticed or known, I don't think I sent anything. Stop going to the freaking cutscene. We seen it already. My goodness. Um, and that I am a I won't say a huge fan, but I am a big fan. That's almost the same thing. Uh, the Tales of series. I played, um, my first one was, um, the Tales of Vesperia, which I have uploaded on my channel that I was practicing with my capture card. I would handle, uh, Xbox 360. And it came up pretty well. Now, um, Tales of Vesperia was the first one that I played. The second one being Tales of Graces F for the PS3. And then, uh, Tales of Azealia that came, that came out after that. And then they remade Tales of Symphonia that was originally, um, on the GameCube, and they remade Tales of Symphonia 2, which was released on the Wii back then. None of these I have didn't even know existed anymore <clears throat> because they were so old and retro. And then after that, Tales of Zillia 2 came out. I played that. I beat. I beat that for the PS. Yeah, for the PS3. And then Tales of um, what was it? Tales of Hysteria came out. I didn't bother playing with that one because it didn't look that good to me. But I've heard like good reviews of it. I may get it. I don't. I don't know. But this one I was the most excited for. I seen a couple gameplays of it. It looked like free roam and all that. And I just wanted to give this a shot. And um, when it when it comes to the cutscenes, I was trying my best not to like talk over it unless it's something that is worth nitpicking over or something funny happens. Then I might remark on that, obviously. But I will try my best to be very active when it comes to these gameplays. I tend to go silent when it comes to playing, which as that's a habit I've tried to break out of when it comes to recording and commentating and stuff. And so, without further ado, let's go ahead and begin a new game. Oh my god, oh. Oh boy. Well, that's about maybe like three minutes. A lot of it, damn, that red moon though. Oh my god. A lot of it is just the same as the previous deals. What is going on here? You hide here, Velvet. I'm going back to help Celica. I'm so scared. Arthur, please. <laughs> oh, You'll God. Did you have to give him an apple? Or Already he's an asshole. Celica enchanted them herself. They'll give you the courage you need to survive. And be an asshole. They will. <laughs> sure they will. Now, have I ever lied to you? Yes. Uh -uh. Oh. I'll come back for you once Celica is safe. It's scary, but don't give in to fear. Don't despair, no matter what. I won't. I promise. After all, I'm Laffy's older sister, and you're a student. Really? I 
I feel like I'm watching a horror movie. What's going on here? What the fuck? A light? What the fuck? I'm gonna try not to curse as much too. I'm trying to try to keep it G-rated. Uh, Flash 4? What was that? Flash 4? On that day, the world began to change. Men and beasts possessed by evil spirits, hunting and killing anyone they could. What the fuck? But even in the depths of despair, only two things matter to me. The taste of blood-soaked flesh. Revenge. And revenge upon one man. Of course. It's always, mostly almost the same. Luffy, time to wake up. What the, what is going on here? Okay. What is going on here? Morning. Uh, I told you to stop calling me Luffy. I'm not a little kid anymore. <laughs> grumble, grumble, huh? You must be feeling good. Um... <clears throat> is this Mila's Bit of a fever, twin sister that I don't know about? At what, least what the new this? medicine's supposed to come today. Until then, you a, stay in bed. That? Got oh. it? What? Assassin's Blade? Aww, She's an assassin? I, to go I didn't to the know cave. that. Sorry, you'll have to wait. Can I at least read a book? Read a book. Read a book. Read a. Okay. Don't trouble your sister, Lafayette. I didn't mean to. Arthur. Done chopping firewood? Yeah, enough to last through winter. But there's something else I need to take care of. Sorry, but medicine money will have to wait a bit. Oh. I can earn it myself then. Bring down a few prickle bores, and I'll have plenty to offer in trade. This is taking longer than I thought. I want to skip Arthur's this, but I also want to know what's going on. Plans must be solid and reactions flexible. All right. I shouldn't doubt my students' abilities. Sorry to put you in the spot. I'm sorry, Velvet. Whoa, hey! What's everyone apologizing for? We're a family, right? Whoa, right. I'll see you later. <clears throat> I whipped up some porridge for you, okay? Be back by evening. Thank you. Be careful, Velvet. Of what? Uh, can we get into the game now? Okay, finally. Uh, the controllers. Uh, uh, I might want to read all that. Oh, jeez. What does that say? A ball village of longing? Oh, 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 that don't sound right. Pause on that. <laughs> okay, so what am I doing here? So uh, apparently we're controlling this girl named Velvet. So I'm guessing it's the main protagonist of this. <clears throat> okay, we're going to go in our site, huh? Mini map. Oh my god, come on, yes. Where to display the map? Oh my god, yes. If I'm on the hunt for prickle boars, I'd better try the tranquil woods outside of town. This is for Luffy's medicine, so I can't mess this up. Yeah, that's good. Hunt prickle, prickle boars and tranquil woods. That sounds kind of familiar. <coughs> now for. Come to think of it. Oh, it's a skit. Oh, oh cool. He hasn't his favorite dinner in a while. There's been so much going on. And the village always has him out hunting. Maybe he's just worn out? That does it. I'll cook him up some prickle boar stew, just like Selica taught me. That ought to pick him right up. A healthy portion of nourishing meat cures fevers and weariness alike. Wow, that, that was interesting. That's a new style of skits that I've never seen before. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> okay, so what are we doing? Just going around town, just picking up, picking up stuff. Um. 
Ever since the opening seven years ago, this world's really gone crazy. Famine, freezing weather, oh. and worst of all, this demon blight that's turning people into monsters. Demon I can't what? believe that people can really turn into those things. <clears throat> it's a nightmare. Does no one know what causes demon blight? Or how to heal it? No. That's what a giant ass dog. That when people just turn into there. those monsters. I mean, demons. They gain incredible strength and attack humans on sight. <sighs> Whoever named it the opening. This is the new, new next generation it's of like underworld. Someone opened a portal directly to hell. Come to think of it, Celica died during the opening, didn't she? The opening it might be a good thing she died when she did. She didn't have to suffer through all of this. It's good that my sister died? How can you say that? Oh, she... Uh, sorry. Oh! I didn't mean it that way. She's dead? You're a real idiot, you know that? Sorry about him, How did she die? I didn't see that. What, huh? Oh my god. Where'd the dog go? Oh, that, yeah, that's a giant... That, that dog's big. Hey, Velvet. Is Lafayette feeling better? No, not yet. He needs a little more rest, I think. Aw, too bad. Tell him I'm looking forward to hunting beetles with him again when he's better. Right, got it. Lafayette's illness sure is persistent. Yeah, that fever still That's, keeps going back. She's a mom? Like she looks work. like an older sister. The medicine always helps a little. They don't even look as remotely alike. Still, that sounds terrible. Let me know if there's anything I can do to help. Thanks, but we'll be fine. At least we've got Arthur to take care of anything that needs muscle. And before he came, Selica raised me and Luffy all by herself. So now I have to do my best too. You sound just like your sister. That optimism must run in the family. I do? That's nice of you to say. Oh, uh, this, this is it. This is an interesting cutscene. Okay, so what I should probably stock up on a few things before I go into the forest. I don't have a lot of money to what? spare. But like Arthur always says, battles are won and lost with the preparations made before the first strike. Huh? Okay, whatever, Polish your whatever the troops do anything. Hey, what's this on there? The what demon is blight is a punishment <coughs> sent to us by the Imperians for forgetting the old prayers. Who are the Imperians? The four Imperians created the world. The one Imperian shall bring it to peace. Be afraid. When contradiction permeates this world, the time of suppression will be upon us. Well, are you okay? Want me to take you home? No! Don't treat me like a child! All right then. Oh, it's you, Velvet. <laughs> if you're going to the Cape, take care. Don't fall into the Shrine of Tranquility, right? I know. I'm not a kid. Of course, of course. You're 13 now, aren't you? I'm 16. Oh, wow. I think you and Ariel will get along just fine. So, am I supposed to buy stuff? Oh, let's see. What does my start menu look like? Oh, okay. Oh, so my HP is 528. I'm level 3, apparently. I have 200 gold. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, <clears throat> no, consumables. I have some apple gel. Okay. Wait, what? Medicine, medical jail heals one. Bleh, heals one allies HP by thirty percent. Cannot be cannot be used while I flick. Oh jeez. Cannot be flicked the. Oh, what the hell? Oh. Huh? Oh, that is so dumb. Really? Really? So you can use this, but it can't be used while you're like burnt or poisoned or something. That is so stupid. Why would you do that? Why would, Why is that a thing? Okay, can we finally get into some battles now? I'm really into for a fight. I wanna see how the gameplay is. Tranquil Woods. Autumn Color Forest. Ooh, this does look beautiful. Okay, so what are we looking for? This area looks promising. So what are we looking for? A hunt prickle prickle boards in the woods. What's this? Comfrey, type of grass. Huh? Oh no, we don't want that. We want to make some delicious ass soup. I mean, I I personally would go for some chicken noodle soup. There, but still. Pickle boar. Oh, we have a fight. Okay, battle tutorial. Power one task can be performed based on the number of souls each character currently possesses. Souls? That sounds kind of demonic. 
is in combination of circle, triangle, or square, and X for a video combo. What? Oh, so this is like, so this is like Tales of Graces, but this is completely different. Different in its own way. By stunning and its luck, by stunning, defeating, or inflicting status ailment upon enemies, you can get souls along for combos. Right, wow. here goes. Wow, that was that Oh, good lord! <laughs> oh, good lord! <laughs> oh, I got some Trickaborn meat. Ew, boss. How did Trickaborn meat? Delicious and nutritious. Yeah, I already know that. Um, what's the guard button? Is there a guard button here? <clears throat> I mean, the guard button is usually... Oh, no, it's good. Hold on. The cold weather's been terrible on everyone's crops, but at least the city will buy our Trickaborn meat now. Luffy and Arthur have been hoping the village could start raising them, but they can just be so temperamental. I wonder if they could be bred with more docile pigs. What would we call them? Oinkle boars? Nah, doesn't sound appetizing. What about Piggle Boar? Yeah, Piggle Boar! That's a cute name. Maybe Piggle too boar? cute, though. We wouldn't want to discourage people from eating them. Pickle boar? That's like putting Winnie the Pooh and Piglet in a blender and putting them together to make some sort of atrocity that's, re that's ready to take over the world. That's sort of... Ugh. I wouldn't want that in my soup. Huh? Oh no! Awww! <clears throat> Can we guard? Ours is so gay. Not Ow! Oh, that's your guard. Depending on Oh cool. No, no. Okay, that's how you guard. Okay, I have to I feel bad now. Arthur, second place. Know your foes and strike where they're weak. Okay. Come on. All right. Not bad. Very nice. <clears throat> All right. So, is there any more? Can we return back to? Oh wait. What's this? What's on the screen? Oh, an apple gel. Cool. All right, we mostly have consumables in there. I feel like there's some Legend of the Zelda. I was actually expecting some rubies in there. <laughs> what is this the save point? Yeah, these are save points. Okay. All right, for the save, well, for the save this, I'm gonna go a little bit further. I want something. I want something critical to happen before we save it. I mean, this is just too much. I mean, we're already going on. At least 22, almost 22 minutes without, um, without editing. So are we done? No, we're not done. We have some more. Right, here goes! Come on, come on, let's get this over with. Come on, I got shit to do. Come on. No, fuck off. Alright. Not bad. Awesome sauce. This sauce. should be enough to cover the medicine. I'd better bring these to the store. Alright, we gotta return to the shop and... A ball. <laughs> oh, what's over here? I see an exclamation mark over here. <sighs> this place isn't safe. That hole's gotten bigger. I, feel like, I, feel I like told them a thousand point times they the ought to build a fence, but they keep saying it's forbidden land. 
Even Celica used to scare me with it. She was always, this is a gateway to the underworld. Well, I'm too old to keep falling for that nonsense. Oh, I was expecting her to fall off. Like, ah, la, 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 ah! <laughs> Alright, so we gotta go back to the town? I mean, I must say, this graphics are kind of phenomenal. Especially if it was on a PS4 engine. This is pretty, this is pretty cool. Pretty dope. I miss a bit. Oh! Wait, the boars I hunted, are you there? What do you think? Maxim 3, never waver once your sword is drawn. Control your feelings to control the tide of battle! Oh, Velvet, really? Okay, what are we doing now? Hit our focus on damage and attack and so use more in the Oh, wait, what? We're selecting arts now? Uh... Wait, what are we doing? Oh, sear searing edge. Oh, well, that's such a dog. Art. Pride and anxiety, pity for the enemy, thrill of victory. Your emotions run too hot. That will be your downfall. Uh. Agreed. It's one of her virtues as well. Huh? Yes, I know. But even so, she's got to. Um. Arthur? Arthur's fourth maxim. Never let your guard down, even when victorious. <clears throat> Got it. Oh, In any case, when is he going to turn into an to asshole? I could just medicine. feel it right now. I'll drop the prickle boars off at the shop before I head out. Head out where? He reminds me the person I was supposed all. to meet is late. I don't think I'll be home reason. tonight. I came out here to let you know. You'll have to pick up the medicine yourself. Right. One more thing. I saw a group of demons near the village. If you're attacked, run away. Am I clear? What? No way! I, I can handle a bunch of- Demons can only be challenged by those with the talent for exorcism. That's the cold logic of the world, and no emotions can change it. Do you think- I could become an exorcist? Um... Does this deal with religious issues? Why is it you think that birds fly? Why? Well, without flying, they couldn't find food. It takes a particular innate talent to be an exorcist. Unfortunately, very few humans have it within themselves. All right. Oh, God. Tomorrow is Selica's Memorial Day. I'll be back as soon as I can. Hurry back! I'll make you a quiche, just the way she taught me. I love how my hair goes straight through my shoulder and my neck. I'm just that magical. 
Oh, cool, I leveled up. Finally. I wonder if those prickle boars were brothers. Maybe I should have let them go. But then, how would I pay for Luffy's medicine? Hunting took care of that. And it means food for us as well. I had no other choice. It was a rational decision. But the fact that I'm still worrying about it shows that my feelings are getting the better of me. Man, we're all such convoluted assholes. I feel so bad now. Okay, we're still returning to the shop. So this is going on 30 minutes. I can't keep I can't keep handing out the run time like this. I don't think any jump cuts is going to save this. Because I want something crucial to happen before I end the gameplay. Oh my god, those dog models are so cute. Nico, here for groceries? Yep. And <laughs> you must have been out hunting. Yeah, it was a good haul. I've never seen a pink Look dog at before. you, Lady Breadwinner. If you were a boy, I think I'd be in love. Good thing I'm a girl. What? Whoa! Nothing oh, wrong yeah? with a little girl longer, actually. You want to do something about your style, then? Uh, yeah. I kind of broke my comb. So get a new one! Oh. Sure, I'd like to, but... Hey, mister! How about a sail on combs for the pretty girl? <laughs> huh? Oh, you two need something? I'm fine, Nico. I'm just here to pick up medicine for Lafayette. Oh, Velvet. I already told Arthur, but I'm afraid the medicine hasn't come in yet. What? Why not? Is it because of the demons? Seems like the demon blight's really taking a toll on the city. There's even a group of them lurking around here now. When's it coming, then? I can't say. And I don't know how much it will cost. Oh, no. Ugh, what is wrong with Midgand? I mean, don't they have an army or something? Those guys? The demons already routed them a while back. Send the but dogs after them. We're safe here, right? After all, your brother-in-law's an exorcist. You so sure about that? Arthur can't even use his right hand anymore. For what? Poor fellow couldn't even protect his own wife and child. Let me know when the medicine gets in. Uh, uh of course. For now, here, on the house. What did he give her? <laughs> when he can't use his right hand anymore, what did he, what did he do? Velvet! He, he kept doing the do. You didn't forget, did you? You promised to teach me how to make your special key. You mean for that apprentice animal doctor you had your eye on? You were serious? Beyond serious? <laughs> Please. This is life or death for me. But what? I thought your folks weren't keen on the two of you dating. Uh. Who cares what people think? The important thing is my feelings. Because you're a girl? <laughs> I oh, like God, the way you talk. If I were a boy, I think I'd be in love. Darn right! Oh. Ah! Oh, where's the girl on girl action when Nothing you need must it? must be starving by now. I better hurry home. For me to get my full commentary on this. Oh, cutscene. As I said, I'm trying not to talk so much during these cutscenes. Oh. Hi, Selica. I'm back. Why I can't is believe this it's been necessary? seven years since we lost you. And the baby you carried. What? Drat. I forgot to bring your princessias. I know how much you, Mom, and Dad all loved those flowers. And I know your child would have too. I'm sorry. I'll pick some from the Cape tomorrow. That's, that's kind of fucked up. <laughs> that's, I'm trying not to cuss as much, but dang. Uh, welcome home, Velvet. Luffy, I told you to stay in bed. I was only up for a little. Look, your fever hasn't gone down a bit. Go lie down and I'll cook dinner. I'm sorry. <laughs> What's this? A 
compass. Oh, wow. It uses a magnet to tell you which way you're facing. Woohoo! You can use the sun and stars for that. And what'll you what do you if it's like cloudy, that? huh? Woohoo! Thanks to this invention, we'll even be able to voyage across the ocean. And run into Edward See? Kenway. It's designed to stay level, so your heading will be true even when the ship is rolling with the waves. Pretty neat, right? If you say so, Luffy. Come on, it's a must-have for any adventure. Can't you see how useful it is? You can tell me more about it later. Did they hurt you? Not a scratch, and I brought back plenty. Where I can hear it? Arthur already. Gosh, Velvet, I think it's time you learned all my secret arts. Really? He isn't coming home tonight, is he? How do you know that? Sarah stopped by and told me. Arthur's Moloch? Huh, oh. you really can talk to Malachim, can't you? Yeah, Arthur says I've got exorcist potential. No kidding. I think you'll be an exorcist to rival even him. Huh? I can tell you've been learning all sorts of things from his book collection. I really want to become an exorcist. I want to go traveling with you and see all the wonders of the world. I bet you do. I'll hunt and chop firewood, and if demons come for us, I'll defend you. Huh. <laughs> okay. I wish... I wish I could do that. Why can't I just call a werewolf or something? But then again, I guess there's overrate is already alive, so I guess they call them Damons with a sword. You'll of get there, Luffy set. Spaling? It should only Spell take. It. Oh, Damn, 20 I years were, po were pointy. Did y'all see that? It won't take me that long. Oh yeah, you better prove it to me then. Start with this lovely meatball stew I cooked. Eat every she last meal. She reminds me food, more and more of Vila because she talks hungry. about food and cooking take your and medicine. all that. No matter how nasty it tastes. No tricks. Am I clear? Yes, ma'am. Carol, I got them giant eyes. Mind right. Some, Cooking time. Some First, stuff. I need to light the stove. Oh, that red, that, that red mark like, looks like we can't, um, we can't go out. Oh, uh, where's the kitchen? That's the, another bedroom. It's over here. What the? Ah, forgot. Isn't this Arthur's book? Is Luffy really reading stuff this dense? <laughs> Poor kid's gonna squint his eyes right out. Oh, really? The day before Scarlet Night, Sis went prickle boar hunting on her own. <clears throat> She's it, almost she as good a fighter as Arthur. So wow. I know those prickle boars don't stand a chance. But I worry that she's too athletic to land a husband. Maybe she should try to be more ladylike. <laughs> Little scamp. He just knew I'd be reading this, didn't he? <laughs> oh, oh, okay, I think I'm on the ladder. Never mind, I, sh I don't think I should be up here. We got some rocks up up here. What's rock stuff doing up here? Can I jump down? Screw the ladder, I'm jumping down! Where is it? Oh, like the stone. It's so easy to light Arthur's <clears throat> firewood. I wonder what his trick is. Um, Velvet? Could you not put any spinach in the stew? Huh. You'll never grow up if you're picky with your food, you know. Mm, I know, but but just for today? <laughs> fine, fine. Wow. I'll leave out the spinach just this once. And I'll make it that curry flavor you like. Really? Thanks, Velvet. There's some you look like a creepy child. curry spice upstairs, isn't there? Uh, what you can- oh my, oh my, oh, scratch me, scratch me, oh, no, never mind. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we're going up the ladder again? Really? Is all this really necessary? There you go. Not Ugh. spicy hot, but oh so delicious. Oh yeah, I saw Nico today, and she had very important things to talk about. She's coming over in the next couple days, so be on your best behavior. I will. I'm glad you've got a good friend. Yeah, we've known each other since forever. Um... Still, Nico falling in love? I can barely wrap my head around it. Laffy, you know, 
If there's a girl you like, you'll tell Big Sister all about it, right? What? Uh, g girl? Hmm. You're a stubborn <laughs> little brat, so you might need an older girl to keep you under control. Oh, and she's got to be a good cook. Really? A pro in the kitchen is a success more at about life. Oh. Knock it off, Velvet! You should be more worried about your own love life. Me? I I've got enough on my mind. For one thing, I've got to cook for you and Arthur since Celica is gone. Besides, getting crushes on strange men? I just don't see what's so... <laughs> Luffy, what's wrong? Jump, jump down the ladder. Are you all right? I'll bring you some water. I'm fine. You just said something funny is all. And it made me choke a bit. <laughs> as long as you're okay. I remember I'm like the one. Sorry, I went off on a tangent there. <laughs> Who knows what the future holds? Yeah, but what more can I do? I've got a duty to look after my little brother, and I'm serious about it. I know, Are they actually but I'm trying to look after you too. I want you to be happy. That's all. And it's not just me. Arthur worries about you too. Oh, this is taking well, way too your long. Your family, right? Oh. Yeah, that's what families do. Oh. Thanks, Luffy. For you, I'd kill every last prickle boar in the forest if it came down to it. <sighs> what am I doing? I need to hurry and get dinner ready. Distractions at his best. I'm I'm doing it wrong. All this, all this cooking and talking about ingredients and all this crap. I feel like I'm on Hell's Kitchen with Gordon Ramsay. Good boy. You didn't forget your medicine. Well, I did promise. Watch as my hair goes through the bed sheets. The powers of an exorcist has its best. Tomorrow's a scarlet night. Yeah, just like that night that changed our lives. Um, Velvet, may I sleep next to you tonight? Of course. Just don't be creepy about it, like you did the other night. I don't know what you mean. I was only sleeping. No, no, that's fine. Just, just, just keep to yourself next time. Hey, I love that music. Dun 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 Oh. <clears throat> okay, let's see. Today, I've got to dry some meat and use that cheese I've been saving to make a quiche for... Hmm? Luffy? You little... Where have you gone? You, you little what? What are you talking, what are you gonna say there, my girl? You better not have gone to the village alone. Uh, I bet your fever hasn't even gone down. <clears throat> well, stop dwelling, you'll find him. Huh? It's still the freaking same. It was just showing that it was daylight outside. Now it's still sunset. Is this like, um, that one place from Super Mario 2? Twi uh, not Twilight Town. Uh, is that what it was called? I think it was called Twilight Town, but I'm thinking of, that'll make me sound like I'm talking about Kingdom Hearts. But <clears throat> I, I, don't, I don't, I don't remember. I think it was called Twilight Town. Hey, has Luffy Set been here? Uh, no, I haven't seen him. <laughs> Wait, that's one of Arthur's. Actually, it's a copy that Lafayette made. <sighs> a smart merchant would pay a pretty penny for this book. I gave him a fair trade. Lafayette, did he really copy all that by hand? That's, he's 
pretty smart kid. Oh, he must have done it to buy that compass. No, though he gave it some puppy eyes. Told him I'd throw it in for free, but he said that it would be a bad deal for me. He's a good lad, but not the merchant type. <laughs> so, what did he use the money for? I'm afraid my lips are sealed. You'll have to ask him. Well, dang. I thought we were friends. Belvin! I saw Loppy set walking around. Is he okay? He's not okay. Where'd you see him? He was headed for the forest. I'll help you look for him. Thanks. Do a sweep of the village, just in case. I'll check the forest. Okay, now it's starting to get juicy. Okay, that's good thing, though. Fluffy! Velvet, can you walk? How's your fever? I'm fine. I was just taking a break. Oh, you little... You know better than this, Lofi said. Running off without telling me. What if something happened to you? You wouldn't be the only one hurt. Do you understand that? I'm sorry. If you want to do something, just ask. I know I'm a crummy big sister, and I can't afford to buy you all the things you want. No, that's not why I went out. You see, it was just... Damn, it's piano. I get it. You're right. I forgot the flowers for the graves. Yeah, so I was going out to the Cape, and I thought... You want to see the ocean too, don't you? Well, yeah, that too. Fine. Just for today, though. Are you sure? I am. But next time you run off like that, I'm strapping you to your bed. Yes, ma'am. Good. It's off to the Cape, then. Hooray! That sound very threatening. Remember how we went out together to pick princessias on the Aww. morning of Celica's funeral? Yeah. I was only four, but I remember. We couldn't find any in the village or at the Cape. Right. Because the demons had made a mess of them. And then you suddenly started climbing down the edge of the cliff. You ran over and grabbed me. You had the scariest look on your face. Of course I did. Do you have any idea what I'd do Lobby's, if I lost you too? Uh, drawn model still looks have like Richard when he was you. young from Tales of Grace. He'll help the world. He's quite the guy. That's probably true. But I'd still miss you like you wouldn't believe. I know. I'm sorry, sis. But down the cliff from where you were, a lone pair of princessia were oh, blooming. Oh, I remember. A gentle breeze came in, and it smelled like Celica. That's right. What? That's why I believe That's those flowers were a okay. message from her. Do you know what Princessia flowers signify? Uh, an irreplaceable treasure. And wishes for good health for many years to come. Right. And that sums up my feelings nicely, Luffy. Yeah. Me too, sis. Um, alrighty then. How about I make you some uh, apple boo when we get home, oh, man. Luffy? Apple boo? What's that? Grated apples. Whenever I caught a cold when I was little, Celica would make it for me. It's sweet and tart and juicy and crisp. Eating it always made me feel better. Well, apples are good for you. But what does the boo mean? When I was a baby, I would always say boo-boo when I wanted to eat an apple. <laughs> so that's where the name comes from. I thought it was something else. Wait, you called apples boo-boo? You must have been a strange baby. You used to do the same thing. When Celica and I heard you, we laughed so hard. Boo! See, what's with the strange transitions? It was just like sunset and now <sighs> it's very bright. These. What is going on? This place never Dude changes, had no teeth. does it? He had no teeth. It does two change. The seasons, the wind, the weather. Change one and the sea's totally different. And the same goes for what lies across the sea. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Across the sea? Sometimes I just don't know what you're talking about. Hey, Velvet. Thank you for taking me out here today. You don't need to thank me. Hey, Luffy. Do you know why it is that birds fly? Well, if they didn't, they couldn't catch food. Or escape from predators. Thought so. But you know, I think there's more to it than that. A bird that's born with wings has to... Uh. What the... What the hell? Oh, bruh! Oh, I'm just relaxing and just enjoying the cutscene. Run! No matter how much it hurts, run! Velvet! Don't be scared. You can do it. I'm not gonna fight this You're thing. going to be strong, like Arthur. No, you can't! Go! Why is a demon here? Let's go. I want to go alone. You have to. Don't let your huh? Oh, get God. Away. Oh, oh nice. Ah, it's, it's just like Arthur said. I have to do this. Damn. This is a rocket. Face me, demon. Oh, really? Damn. Oh. Velvet. Wow, he bought the call. Is this what? Arthur to save the day. I knew it. Uh, first point, first person point of view, critical plot moments. Dang it! I was hoping this wouldn't mean the game, but okay. How? How did I get home? Velvet. Luffy. You're all right. Uh, sorry. It's all my fault. No. If you weren't there, there's no telling what might have happened to me. Your old one broke, right? You've got beautiful hair. It would be a waste if you didn't take care of it. I'll make a new world. A world where my sister can be happy. What? Is he gonna die? Why did he say that? Or does he plan to... I really don't know. Does she fall asleep again? <laughs> Bruh! The Scarlet Knight? What's going on? Was that... Was it all a dream? No, no, it wasn't. Oh, sheesh. What is going on? Uh oh. Now things are starting to go down. Oh! 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 No! What's happening? What was that Bobby, supposed to do? Where are you? Are they after me? Oh sheet! Oh, oh sheet! Oh sheet! Oh sheets! And bed sheets! Go! What is going on here? What on earth is going on? This is no time to be scared. I have to find Loppy! Oh god, everybody died! Oh god! 
Oh, oh, bruh, 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 no, no, no. Oh, uh, no, 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 you, no, 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 you're good, my boy, you're good, oh. Oh, God, I'm not good at this. Oh, God, it looks like you're going to lose. You can always try to run away. Oh. Go away. Where is the blue line? Okay, here we go. Get, get out of here. I'm, I'm gone. I'm not doing this. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 Oh my god! Why are they running like that? Oh my god, they're everywhere! This is ridiculous! Oh my god! Bruh! Bruh, bruh, bruh! Bruh, bruh, bruh! Bruh, 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 no! Oh my god! Okay, now things are starting to get interesting. This really is a horror story! Oh my goodness! No, not by my chest! No, no, you can have that, my boy! You can keep that! You can keep that! Okay, I'm gonna save real quick. Hold on. Lappy, Arthur. What's going on up there? Velvet. You. Oh, thank goodness. You kept Lafi safe, didn't you, Arthur? One more sentiment to cast off. Velvet, run! Arthur! What the heck? <laughs> bruh! A bruh! Whoa, what's going on here? Hold on a second. Here, once, was the seal to the underworld broken. And tonight... Here shall be born the power to save the world. With Lucas's life as a sacrifice. What? What are you saying? Hold on, wait a minute. That's not how it happened. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. I remember... I remember on, I seen a video, they said that they censored this one in the Japanese version. In the Japanese version, they say that Arthur stabbed him. What is this right here? I mean, it's kind of cool, but why did they change it? Because it's showing a child get stabbed? I mean, if that's the case, then how is this one any different from what's about to, what's about to happen? See, watch, watch, watch. Arthur, no! He gets stabbed. What the hell? How is this any different? <laughs> and then you see the blood stain right there. What the hell? That didn't even look like it hurt. Let him go. This is an offering to the world. Oh god. Why would you? Nothing can save him now. Uh, oh god. No, no, no! Wait, are they different? I see you not change. Chop off her hand?
Is her, old, is her old arm still over there? spread through the village. But do not fear. Stab him in a dick? With my power as an exorcist. <coughs> I, Artorius Colbrant, will end your pain. Is it that birds fly? Behold my answer, Velvet. Arthur. I ask no forgiveness. The sin is mine to bear. Okay, that that went from zero to one hundred real quick, and I leveled up. Heck yeah! On lower battle difficulties, enemies attack less frequently and with less force, making them easier to defeat. But higher difficulties offer benefits, such as improved battle drops from enemies. I mean, I'm playing this on normal just to give so just to get used on everything. Come to an end. So that's what I was waiting for, for so I can years. end the gameplay. Oh, well, what? I sat in that pit of darkness and fed. Devouring demons. You had a fucking tiger? Really? So I could live. So I could live long enough to kill him. And be my brother's vengeance. Dang, man, this this just took a turn for the worse. So how long has she been in there? 
And this reminds me of Tales of Asperian when Yuri was thrown in jail. Hello. And you didn't use the po never mind. <laughs> <laughs> this is what it has. Again, you didn't use the freaking ladder to come down with it. Why? But either way, your ankle should have broken. <laughs> Are we gonna have a battle now? Where is he? Now she looks like Mila. First, there will be a test. It will decide if you are worth teaching. L1, L1, and a left stick to him. Nope. Oh, nice. Here I come. If you are not, I will kill you. Ready yourself. I can use that right here. Well, oh, sick and series, level 5. Okay. Okay, she's re resistant to win, I think that was? Yeah, resistant to win. Why are you holding back? You noticed. Well done. You pass. Damn right I did. Of course. His Moloch would never be so weak as that. I am his Moloch no longer. <sighs> First, let me tell you what has transpired these past three years. It's been three years? Hold on, what? There are exorcists now throughout the land, challenging the reign of demons with the help of... Tell me. Tell me where Artorius is. You may find him in the capital city of Logris in Midgand. Midgand. You won't stop to listen. I can tell you what it was you saw that night. That night, the ritual he performed shifted the very course of the world. Sure did. A host of Malachim descended, and with their strength, the emergent exorcists quelled the demon tide. Now, he serves as leader of the Exorcist's Abbey, an institution that enjoys the unconditional faith of the kingdom and public. A shield to guard the people, and a sword against demons. Artorius Colbrand, the world's savior. He also killed my brother. With power stolen us? by sacrificing Lafisat. That's it. <laughs> Indeed. But his power is not yet absolute. The man can still be killed. Why are you doing this? Make a successful escape from this place, and I'll explain. What? Dang! <laughs> wow, this Escape? Is... So that's your game. I'm just looking at her torn outfit. Fine. I don't care what the world thinks of me. What matters is my vengeance against Artorius. That's all. Man, she looks even more like Mila Maxwell. Shattered your yoke. We must hurry. Yoke? What the freak? Huh? What did that mean? <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> well, there's eggs everywhere? Now nah, I'm hungry. Where's the mix at? Oh, the breakfast? I haven't eaten in haven't eaten in like three years. Oh, wow. I almost leveled up. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was just skimming through that. Oh boy. So is there any safe- There's still no save points! Damn it! So we just have to escape. 
great. And still, there's still no save point. I want to end this now. That's going on way too long. I feel like I'm live streaming. There are weapons in the room ahead. I didn't even know what I picked up. I need to see if that's it. What room? I don't even see a door. What kind of hallway is this? There are no doors. Oh my god. Bruh. Okay, here's a door. Uh oh. No one raised the alarm. I can see that. Take what you need from here. Really now. What's this? Oh, I see something back here. Yes. It looks like they kept prisoners' effects in here. Rope. This will be useful. That's kind of kinky. Quite a blade. I know that sword. Stormhowl. What is it doing here? Well, it's too big for me. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> It's a celebrated masterpiece. And if I can't use it, it's worthless. Damn. How can you use that? Okay. Ooh. She got all that from inside the chest. Okay, she got her blade back. That's cool. Oh, that's a different blade. Oh. All right. Are you ready then? What's going on here? Oh, it's a knife. Be careful. He's Ow. not ordinary. He's an exorcist orderly. Ow. Oh, damn, right in the face. You didn't even flinch. I already told you. I am his Moloch no longer. Is there a ship waiting? So you already know we're on an island. Yes. I've learned that this is a prison island for violent criminals. And that there are scores of demons locked away here. Demons say lots of things when they don't want you to eat them. The prison has docks at both the front and rear entrances. Our ship is on the back side. Of course. Got it. The back docks. Okay, here we go. It's nice to have have a like. Never mind, I don't know what. It's nice to have like a. I don't even know. I don't even know how much health she has or whatever. Oh, looks like I can't go that way. Oh, my God, finally, the save point. Thank goodness. Now we can end. Now we can end this shit. Even though I want to like go, like continue a little bit more. But the reason, I, as I said earlier, the reason I kept going on was to make sure that something interesting happens so I can end it. Not just have like end it with nothing happening whatsoever. I want at least something major, something tragic to happen to make the gameplay even more interesting. That's why I kept going for so long. But I didn't like that it took that long. But then again, it's, it was the same thing with all the previous tales up. Tales of um game, so I kinda I should have seen that coming. And so that was pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you like what you saw, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, share it with your family. Again, sorry that it took so long to do this. And I, I hope you guys appreciate my little parody of uh, Corey Kenji's intro. I I have no intention of, of taking it. I just wanted to do that because uh, he's, a, he's a cool dude. I mean, you should subscribe to this channel if you haven't. I mean, who hasn't already? Dude, the dude is a freaking legend here in michigan he, he's here in michigan even though i haven't seen him yet hope oh to like meet a whole bunch of other youtube celebrities but that's besides the point point. and so if you guys really want to like uh see another video of this make sure to let me know in the comment section down below also make sure to subscribe to my channel check out all the other videos that i have that i have done make sure to add me on facebook add me on twitter add me on google plus add me on steam add me on twitch add me on D um, dvnr add me on ties on ties and stuff and so this is master gill and i'll see you all next